Bonjour, hello, I'm Copycat, let's play some Ori and the Blind Forest Definitive Edition. We are in the Spider Coves. And we have just unlocked our pass down there. But, hey, enemies respawn quickly, so we have to fight our way down there. So, in case you missed the first two episodes, this is Ori. A beautiful game where you play this little creature. Trying to save the world, I guess, because the spirit tree. The spirit tree that gave us birth has some enemies. Like the owl we saw in the cinematic. So, right now I'm just working carefully, fighting spiders. Trying to get. To the next part. The final objective is to go through the three temples, but for now we are going to the temple of water. And this means we have to go through the, the spider code. Alright, so abilities. We have one. I can see an Elsa brain on the left. Is there a way to access it? Not sure. I don't see a pass to there. It looks like the pass is on the left side. So maybe that's just a trick. No. Okay, we can't. Not right now. So let's keep going. Let's keep going. Me and my friend Sane. We are going to save the tree. Save the spirit tree. Oh, I can see the map fragment on the left side. We need that to be able to get the map of the area. So that would be useful. Let's go there first. Now we need to find the map stone. Because without the map stone we won't be able to spend this, this uh, map fragment. But it should not be very far from there. Who is this guy? New type of enemy. Oh, there we go. As I said, not far. So, let's check the map. Oh, this is huge. On the top left is something very suspicious. Could be a boss area. And our objective is to go to the right side. I guess the pass will be blocked to go there. It might even be the pass up there. And we don't have the ability to get there. So my guess right now is we need a new ability. So let's explore the spider codes. There are some stuff to be seen there. The Thornfeld Swamp. Yeah, maybe that's the way that is blocked. So that's dangerous. Okay, I did not saw the two, two left, two guys left. I don't know, maybe that's the way. A checkpoint, let's say. Yep, if we want to go up there, we need to push that rock, that rock on the other side, to be able to step on it. So careful with the traps. Move on. Whoa, close. 
So can I jump high enough to get there? Maybe not. Maybe that's what I'm missing. Yep, definitely missing something. So we need to head back. And to get a jump higher ability or some sort. Okay, this guy are no joke. But let's explore the spider cove. Oh, there is an upgrade up there. I can't climb that, though. Oh. Ouch, sorry Yuri. Now that's a really dangerous enemy. C'est bien on fire. see this uh, he shot things that stuck on the ground and that's really dangerous there is an air subgrade down there but I don't have any way to get to it let me put down a checkpoint because this looks like yeah this kind of trouble So we now have six life points. That's good, that's good. Oh yeah. Since we put that down, let's spend the ability point we have. So I wanted to go to the air dash abilities. But you know what I need to find to fight a little stronger because these guys are really annoying. So I will go up all the way up to the double shot. This will kill us in one hit. Oh no, I think I need to go. This will also kill us in one hit. Okay, this area is really dangerous. I need to be extra careful. So I really hope this is the correct way, but I don't see another one, so it must be it. But yeah, suddenly the difficulty increased like a lot. The enemy are no joke. I need to outrun this guy with the laser. get him to kill that door for me? That would be convenient, but I'm not sure if I can. Okay, careful, careful. Now, how do I open that? What's on the other side? Not sure. Seems like a checkpoint. So I need to go on the left. So maybe if I get him to slow down a bit, he will be able to... 
Yeah, just like that. Nope. This is not working. Hey, let's just put down the checkpoint because this is a bit scary. <laughs> See what I mean? They can one shot us. Let's see, maybe if I make him start from further away, he will jump. Further, he will make a longer jump. I'm just blindly guessing right here. Yeah, I think that's the idea. I'm onto something. But it is not an easy idea to execute. So let's get rid of the first one there first. Like that. And let's wait for the second one. Come on. Any moment now. Maybe I'm too close to the spawn, so he doesn't want to spawn kill me. I failed. I failed. Damn it, I think I'm onto something, but it's not easy to, uh, to execute, you know. about this guy? No. Oh, I survived one hit. I can survive this. Well, I'm a bit lost. Yeah. No idea what to do or, or how to do it. Maybe I can bump him with that? Nope. Well, I might have took the wrong turn somewhere. Yes, I have definitely wandered off the wrong path. So let me go back. I need to find a way to open this. Okay, so we did make, we did lost a lot of time over nothing. I have no idea where we are supposed to go next, but we we'll keep wondering a bit. I think I've been able to open some paths, but I need some sort of stomp ability to go. Yeah. Anyway, you have reached the end of the episode. Thanks for watching. Bye.